A Lincoln High School teenager has blisters on her swollen hands following what her mother calls was a questionable form of punishment. Fox Force Phil Alvarado is at Lincoln High School right now with more on what happened. Phil. Well, Steve, the Dallas School District says that uh, Lincoln High School made a police report as soon as the principal uh, found out that a teacher's assistant who works as a cheerleading coach had uh, uh, punished uh, one of their students by uh, making her crawl on her hands and knees on the track here. Uh, the district says it's a punishment that no one at the district condones. I don't feel like that should be done to a dog. She said it hurts to open them. Chiara Williams has blisters on her hands and her left arm is in a sling. She says a coach at Lincoln High School punished her by making her do bear crawls on her hands and knees at the track. At first when she told me to do it, I looked at her with, like, what is that? You can see her mother is not pleased. I really think it was torture and child abuse. I don't think it was no form of fashion of punishment. Child Protective Services went to the family's house to talk with the 14-year-old cheerleader about what happened. The mother says CPS was notified by a nurse at Parkland Clinic where she took her daughter for treatment. I'm against this because of child abuse. I'm not against punishment at all. William says students have breakfast in their classroom, and that's where it started. She said she was ready to begin class, and I had two more chips left in the bag, and I didn't want to throw them away, so she told me to get out. At the school, when you get in trouble, they take you to your coach and let them punish you. Williams estimates she had to bear crawl about halfway around the track. For a minute, then I went again, stopped, get up for a minute, went again, stopped, get up. Bimpy Williams says she took her daughter to the principal, who told her the school is looking into what happened. You have to accept what you get when you don't obey. But for her to make her do that, no, sir. A Dallas school district says that uh, this kind of punishment isn't approved anywhere in the district's uh, code of conduct. A district won't say uh, what action it will take against uh, the teacher. Uh, the mother says she kept uh, her daughter out of school today and probably will until Friday. Steve? Phil Alvarado, South Dallas, thanks.